Welcome back to the show and now let's continue with the fun. Now, gone are the days when rocking an African print or kitenge seemed somewhat strange, especially for the youth. These days, the streets, uh, the red carpets and even the offices have been bombarded with clothes made from the African print fabric, worn by individuals who are now starting to embrace the African fashion culture and most importantly, the work tailors and designers such as Ruth Musiemi are putting in. Let us now talk fashion with this talented tailor. Enjoy! The powerful sewing machine roars rhythmically as the hands of Ruth Musimi skillfully move with intuition a piece of fabric against the sharp needle, ushering the beginning of the fabric's transformation into a fashionable work of art. Mimi naitua Ruth, um, Ruth Musimi, I am a tailor and a designer, but mostly a tailor, anyone can design. With an erudite background in operating sewing machines, the missing part of the puzzle was to learn how to choose and partition the fabric, and this was where apprenticeship came into the picture. Tailoring for me, it's a passion. So I went to school and did become courses. But then again, before I could get a job, I got tired of staying at home. So um, I went to my tailor, the one who used to make my clothes now and um, I asked him if he can teach me, so that's how I started. Well, it was not 100% new. I knew how to operate machines. The only thing I did not know how to do was cut patterns, like for a shirt, a skirt, a dress. I didn't know how to do that. But if, if anything, if someone had cut the pieces for me because I know how to use the machine, I could put the pieces together. So basically what I got from him was now making the patterns because my mom used to have a, a tailoring shop when I was growing up, so I was familiar with the machines and how they work. A formidable combo of both the right machinery and the right fabrics are the resources Ruth needs to actualize her creative fashion ideas. Basically, there's two major, okay, not two major, okay, one major one, and then this, okay, there's the sewing machine, the one that puts the stitches together, and there's the overlock machine, that one is for, for covering, um, what are they called, loose, Loose edges so that the fabric doesn't run, so that is called the overlock machine. Nakuna hi ingine yatundu, the one that makes holes, kwa shirts, buttons, yeah. The examples I can give when it comes to fabrics, kuna ankara, bitenge, that is. So, uh, those, like the one I'm wearing, this is an, an African fabric, ankara. So, there's Ankara, and then there's, there are categories when it comes to Ankara. So Ankara, I can think of three types. There's now these normal prints, there's Kente, the ones that look like they are tribal-ish, and then there's tie and dye. So that one is for Ankaras, and then these other fabrics, we have chiffons, we have some other cottons, there's just so many fabrics. Uh, satin, silk, velvet. Ruth admits having more people join tailoring has jump-started the industry altogether to meet the demands of a fast-growing young clientele who are now embracing the African prints. Personally, I think it will contribute sana for the industry to be able to at least kuna youth wengi when wameanza ku embrace hizi kazi initially mtu angemaliza shule atumwe university akafanye os dribicom law medicine those things but at least hizi watu wameanza ku embrace skills unapata hadi wanawake kwa mijengo so i think hiyo ku embrace skills inafanya kama ingekuwa ni kitambo ingekuwa hata nikitaka kushonewa nguo i have to go find a very mature lady or man to do it for me and probably hata elewa design venye mimi nataka percent of what we are national ni watu si mature sana si like people like my mom's age ni watu wenye tume maybe youth youth to na middle age people na sana sana youth kwa sababu 
number 1 hata nikianza kushona si nilianza na mimi mwenyewe so um, mtu wako na style kama yangu akiniona they would be like hi ebu nishonee kama hiyo yako so mostly napata clients wenye wanapenda designs zangu but uh, there are these other clients mtu anaona eh no umeshona hivi vizuri hata kama it's not my my style can you do this other thing for me but mostly watu wangu ni wa young youths just like any other business a few challenges are bound to surface along the way some of which she says have been assuaged by working with others ye na kuanga a major challenge by the way because si kila mtu anakuanga open minded enough kuelewa ati amependa hii nguo but body type yake ni tofauti so you really have to handle it with i don't know emotional intelligence usije ukaambia mtu kitu oneni kama you trying to speak something negative about their body or something cuz it all goes down to their body not the piece so you just have to be very smart about it could you express umwambia eh hapa hii kidogo naona ni kama ungeka better na kama if, if you have examples like pictures online you can even go there umuoneshe unaona huyu ametengenezwa hivi kwa sababu ako hivi na hivi na hivi na hivi it's hard but at the end of the day hakuna job inanga challenges so unajaribu tu but it can be tricky when you work as a team you tend to share ideas eh uh, you get motivation from each other step by step slowly but surely Ruth plans to continue exploring and expanding her craft with the end goal of one day penetrating the international market in the next i don't know a few years ama mali penye ningependa kuona nguo zangu zimefika ningependa at least i don't know um ku grow to ni kwe of course i have to start locally so i get known here in kenya first before i go niende nikijulikana huko kwingine but that is my dream to be a very big tailor What I can say is talent pays. You can go to school yes, you get your papers. Lakini not all of us tutaandikwa. Alafu pia hiyo time ya kutafuta you could be using your talent. Jukia economy ni mbaya. So what I can say is talent pays. Zenzi zangu mnaweza zipata kwa social media. Instagram naitwa Ruth House of Musini. I'm just Musimi and then Facebook ni Musimi Designers Well these days I guess you can never go wrong with anything that has Kitenge on